Welcome into episode number 164 of The Voice Behind The Voice. I'm Sean Aronson, the TV and radio broadcaster for the St. Saint Paul Saints, an independent minor league baseball team in the Twin Cities. I'm not going to lie, I don't know how I look right now on camera. I can't look very good at all. Not that I look great any week, but we have absolutely played some of the most abysmal, atrocious, and garbage baseball over the last week, and yet we went 5-2. and two. I'm doing this on Monday like I normally do, but coming off of a Sunday in which we sat through a 2-hour and 46-minute rain delay, an additional 24-minute rain delay in the ninth inning, and played 3 hours and 55 minutes in which we walked a franchise tying 12 batters in a game only to lose 11 to 10 some of the worst baseball i've ever watched in 19 years of doing this but at 24 and 11 your st paul saints your new favorite team first place right now and as i've told everyone at the end of the year and again yesterday's game was not the only poor game that we played this week they don't ask you how you won the games just that you did. So, so far right now, 24 and 11, things are going well. And really, that is all that is going on in my life right now. We are in the midst of day, this is day 14 of 16 in a row, just trying to get to this Thursday to get the day off and then start a 17 game uh, consecutive without a day off. But that's this part of the season. This is what happens. It's, uh, it's summer, and uh, it has not hit the state of Minnesota yet because it's done nothing but, but rain since summer officially started. But I got really nothing else to report. That's, that's all I've got going on in my life right now. Hopefully next week or the week after, I'll have some exciting news to tell you. With that said, it's episode number 164 with Matt Devlin of the Toronto Raptors. Now, last week, I brought you a re-aired episode of John Kelly the voice of the St. Louis Blues, because the Blues had won the Stanley Cup. This is not a rebroadcast. This was done at the end of the NBA season when Toronto came to town. So I've held on to it for a couple of months here. And who knew that the Toronto Raptors would be the NBA champions later on, and I would bring you the episode with one of their broadcasters, Matt Devlin. So we don't get into any of that. Like If we had talked right after the NBA Finals, perhaps I would have discussed that with him. But uh, this was done before that. Did it at the hotel where, where the team stayed at. Uh, great guy. He was at the, the Doug Flutie Hail Mary game uh, in, uh, you know, between Boston College and, and Miami. Uh, he talks about a, a bunch of different things, but in terms of how he went from Memphis to Charlotte to Toronto, he was the first ever broadcaster for the Charlotte Bobcats and uh, when they were the Bobcats, and uh, how he's worked for the MSG. Uh, and a bunch of other places. So um, some some good stories w within this. If you have not subscribed to the podcast, you can do so. iTunes or wherever you get your podcast. Be sure to rate us and then follow us on social media. On Twitter, at The Voice BTV. Facebook, facebook.com backslash The Voice BTV. And you can always email me, The Voice BTV at gmail.com. All right, let's get to it. Episode number 164 with Matt Devlin of the Toronto Raptors. JW, I hope you look better than I do. Roll the open. I said, you know, hey, I have this opportunity. He goes, well, what if I don't let you go do that? I'm like, come on, you know. I'm going to make more in two days than, you know, I'm making in a month here, yeah, you know, right. is what I'm thinking. I'm like, well, he goes, well, this must have been in, you know, now I got to find somebody. I said, well, I'll find whoever, I'll find this person, right? And, you know, this is great because it, you know, allows me to go on. You know, yeah, I mean, we had a nice conversation. Of course, he's like, of course, you know, go do it. 